In this video, I would like to explain about uh, the civil engineering as a career and uh, how they can get, uh, what is the range of the salaries and packages and what is their growth. And uh, we also compare with how it be the job in private and government field uh, as a civil engineer. If you see the different sectors uh, in civil engineering fields, uh, so either first one we have is structural engineering. In structural engineering, either we can go as a designer or a modeler. And uh, I'll explain in detail in later slides regarding designer and modeling, what is meant by modeling everything. And second field we have is transportation engineering. And third field we have is estimator and evaluator. And fourth one is irrigation channel designer and uh, environmental engineer. And sixth one is as a surveyor we can uh, do. And uh, among, if you compare all these six, uh, in the structural engineering field we have a lot of uh, job opportunities in a private sector and uh, transportation is completely government sector so government projects will be given to few companies so uh, relatively the opportunities are very less in transportation compared to structural engineering i'll explain in detail in coming slides uh, so coming to the structural engineering uh, we have two opportunities either you can become a design engineer or a modeler in design engineering uh, either you can choose rcc uh, RCC structure in that you use ETAPS mostly and then STAT Pro and if you come to this uh, structural steel uh, either it may be the Indian buildings or US AIC standards or Indian standards Indian codes or European or uh, UK uh, you can use a uh, STAT Pro and uh, if you come to modeling modeling is one of the emerging field right now really we have very good opportunities in modeling the two using Tecla structures and uh, just within uh, 20 days you can uh, start your career uh, just by learning few tips in Tecla uh, you can do you can start your journey as a detailer within uh, under six months you can go to e-plans and under uh, six to seven months you can start your career and within one year you, you can become a good modeler uh, by using Tecla structures, this has, see this uh, among all these fields, Tecla structures has very good opportunities. And then we have SDS2, so it is also similar to the Tecla only, but the software is different. So now coming to the transportation engineering, uh, first one we have is uh, this uh, road designs. In that we use civil 3D and uh, second one we have the traffic volume studies and the third one we have the road safety audits and the fourth one we have the junction improvements uh, these are the four core areas in which the transportation engineers uh, works and uh, coming to this first figure uh, this is what we show us about the civil 3d okay this is the civil 3d and uh, in this uh, it, it is it is similar to this autocad autocad uh, autodesk only developed this uh, civil 3d uh, in this uh, we we do all these uh, geometric designs and all and coming to this uh, uh, visim it is a volume study, it is a simulation tool, in this uh, we can get the green time, how much green time we must provide, what will be the cycle length and uh, complete simulation we can get in this uh, VSIM software, this is also one of the high end software, in this uh, we can get high, uh, all the traffic volume uh, uh, data we can get analyzed in this VSIM software. Coming to the estimation and valuer. Uh, estimation means uh, they have very good opportunities if they start uh, as a consultancy and all and uh, every company also either it may be the steel or RCC every company has the estimator to do the estimation of the quantity of the steel uh, how much time they will complete the work and all uh, not that much growth compared to structural design engineer and all estimator may not have that much growth it depends it depends uh, upon the company and all and then uh, second thing we have the irrigation channel designer this is also we have very less opportunities uh, we don't get jobs uh, as uh, the structural engineer get but they also have very good decent career they use a software called Equaterra and uh, coming to the uh, environmental engineering it is also the mostly the government sector will take all the environmental uh, like uh, water treatment solid waste management everything is taken by the government only so uh, compared to the structural and transportation engineering, uh, these three fields have very less opportunities and estimation we have very good opportunities if they start their career as a consultant uh, uh, like valuation and all, they have very good uh, career. 
so finally civil engineering as a career if you compare uh, salaries and growth uh, and also if you compare with civil engineering with it uh, each have their own uh, advantages and disadvantages and uh, civil engineering if you compare salaries uh, they're not too high but uh, it depends it depends on the candidate they get around the mid range salaries like uh, 20 25 to 30000 like that uh, they'll get and further the career completely depends upon the attitude of the person how he how he will uh, learn the new softwares how he acquired the new skills and how he will lead the team everything the team uh, management it is also very important to go to the project manager level and all um growth is depends upon completely depends upon the person and how he is taking the risk and how he is taking the challenges everything uh, depends upon the individual to individual so if you compare the civil engineering uh, government versus private so government you have very decent career and uh, you'll come across lot of contractors and all so government you have very decent life private it it completely depend upon the person and how he mingles and how he will take the challenges and how he will grow his career is completely depends upon him and uh, finally if you compare uh, with it like uh, data science and uh, cyber security they have very good uh, you know uh, challenging career with high packages and also they must be updating and all so we can't compare civil engineering with uh, uh, it so each have their own advantages So finally this is the conclusion it depends upon the individual person